Hey everybody, yes, yeah, Sam back once again, and we're going to check out this. The Samsung Fast Charge Wireless Charger, and it's the pad type. I didn't know there was any other. Let's check it out. So yes, this is the official Samsung one. Now, I actually got this uh, given to me with my official uh, Galaxy Note 5. So... What we're going to do is we're going to open it up, and I've uh, still got the plastic on there. I've actually taken it off and put it back on, as you can probably tell, just about here. I'm just going to pop this out. Uh, if I can get it out. Come on, come back out. Uh, you were out about 20 seconds ago before I put you back. Yeah, okay. That was annoying. So, you get a quick start guide, which is pretty big. This one's for, uh, based in the Philippines, so I don't know if it's any different. Now, that's one thing I really like. That's it. You don't get anything else. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to use the one that came with your Galaxy Note 5 or your Galaxy S6, whatever phone you are buying this with, then you want to do that. Let's take this plastic off there and we'll stick that back on there now. And here it is. So yes, it is the Samsung Fast Charge. Now, something that interests me is it's got a fan inside here. Uh, this is kind of like a rubbery kind of material, so if it's going to be put down there, it's nice and uh, sticky. It's not sticky sticky, but it's not going to fall around. And it is the new fast charge one. Now, you can, on your Note 5 and your S6 Edge Plus, you can turn this into a normal wireless charger. You can actually tell the phone to tell this not to charge it faster. A little confusing, but you can do it, and I'll, I'll show you. If I, if I can remember where it is in the settings, I will show you. But you are going to need to use the cable you do get included with your uh, S6 Edge Plus, uh, your S6, or whatever phone you want to use it with. Um, what we're going to do is we're just going to do normal cable and we're just going to use this just for the purpose of this video because I can't actually get a plug to where I am right now. So what I will do is I will plug it in with this one here. Again, this is just plugged into a power bank. So you just want to plug it into the bottom of that one there. And that is now plugged into there. I don't know if you can see it's kind of got that little uh, light. I don't know if you saw it. So what we'll do now is we'll just pop that there. We will put our Note 5 onto it. And... Hey presto, we're now charging our device. Now I don't know, I don't think it does. It just does normal wireless charging. Now I thought this was the case because I, I did a little test but I, I honestly forgot. Um, if you charge the device with a normal USB cable and not the adaptive fast charge, from, from what I remember, you only get normal wireless charging. So as you can see, I'm using a power bank here. This only got a one amp output. But if you're using a, like say, 2.4 amp output, you're then generally going to get your your fast wireless charging. So you need to use a decent charger. Try and use the one that came with your device if you can. If you can't, just try and buy one or find one that's a nice 2.1 or 2.4. Or try it higher, but I'd stick to around 2.1 to 2.4. And you will then generally get your, uh, your fast charging. So I'm just going to turn it on. You can probably see here. Hopefully you can see here if it starts to... Put your phone on there. Charge. There we go. See it there? We're now getting told it's actually charging the device. So you see it's on the screen, it's charging. So we'll turn it off there. And you get a little uh, blue LED one there. And once it's fully finished, it does go to a solid green, which is pretty cool. And you can see there, it's just showing that it's actually charging the device. Um, all in all, I'm actually very impressed with the charger. Uh, I'm almost knocking my camera over again. It looks nice. It, it feels nice and this little ring here I'm not worried about just kind of chucking my device on there as you can probably tell it's very very kind of sticky on there it will slide off if it's like that but obviously it's probably going to slide off like that but if it's on a flat surface and it's at a bit of an angle as you can probably tell there that boy oh boy ain't going nowhere and all those people on ne uh, Nexus 4 know exactly what I mean with regards to wireless charging on these little uh, kind of plates Falling off all over the place. So again, all you do is you stick your device onto it. Give it a couple of seconds. Boom, it is now charging. Um, from my tests, in terms of the fast wireless charging, it takes around, I think it's around two, just under three hours to fully charge my device from dead. And that's the Note 5. And um, if you're charging it with a cable, I think it takes about two hours, just under two hours. So it is a bit slower but it's still faster than a normal Qi charger. So if you want to pick this one up, again, the link is in the description. And if you can afford it and you, you've got a device that can take, you know, that does benefit from that, then 
get this one you will not be disappointed i would recommend this one over a standard chi charge if again if you want to pay the difference i think they're around 40 pounds or something like that on amazon right now again the link's down below and you can go pick one up if you want one but what do you think are you impressed by what samsung have done with the fast charge wireless charging fast charge wireless charging or is it fast wireless charging i don't know what they want to call it i'm very impressed with it and the fact that i can just come in just stick my phone down it starts charging and i can walk out and it's fully charged and it keep and it charges it quick using this is like using an old charger let's say an old worn up charger to charge your phone this is pretty much giving it the same kind of performance but wireless how cool is that huh yeah i think it's pretty pretty damn cool oh actually before i go i actually forgot to say i was going to show you where on the actual phone is so if you go into your phone um, you can actually turn off, you can disable fast wireless charging. You don't know why you'd want to, but you can do. When you go into your settings, go all the way down to the bottom and click accessories. And here, you can see that fast wireless charging. It says charge your battery more quickly. You may hear a fan noise when using the fast wireless charging. It's fast wireless disabled, standard wireless charging will be used instead. So if you want to, you can disable the fast wireless charging. I don't know why they give you this option. I'm going to guess because this might get a little warm. I've not had any major issues. I've heard the fan kick up a little bit, but nothing, you know, nothing to where it's going to start taking off. So, yeah, if you want to, again, you do need to use a high-end charger with this one. So if you just use a one-amp charger, it's not going to do a fast charge, and you need to use, try and use the one that comes included with your Samsung device. If not, you need a high-end uh, fast charger to use the fast wireless charging. Anyway, let's finish the video. Anyway, if you have any questions about the fast charge, the fast wireless charger, however you want, whatever you want to call it, you know what to do. You can hit me up down below. Don't forget to hit me up on Twitter at Sam J Pullen. If you do enjoy my videos, then please hit the like button. Please don't forget to hit the like button and go on, subscribe. It's free. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. Focus. And you'll see me in my next one. Cheers, everyone.